six, five, four. Just start. Two, one. <laughs> And there she goes. New Shepard has cleared the tower on its way to space. With its crew of six, they are screaming up towards the Carmen line. Max Q has been confirmed. Our next milestone here is main engine cutoff. And what we'll witness is the speed will start to come down, but the uh, the excel excuse me, the, the altitude will continue to go up. When the speed hits zero, it means we have hit apogee. All right, main engine cutoff and separation have been confirmed. And there it is, Apogee, about 340,000 feet. So we see the drag brakes have been deployed. There's the relight of that BE-3 engine. That gorgeous hover above the landing pad. And booster touchdown, a successful touchdown of the booster for the NS-26 mission. Always a sight to see. So there she is. And again, these parachutes, both the drogues and the mains, are essential in providing a gentle touchdown for the capsule. But as we get closer to the ground here, you're going to see a retro thrust system on the base of the capsule, um, which k does kick up a bit of West Texas dust, but it makes for an even smoother touchdown. Then again, you know, like you said, the already slow speed that the capsule is descending at now. We're just 400 feet away from touchdown. Again, stay tuned for that retro thrust system here. And crew capsule touchdown, welcome home to the newest six astronauts, the Blue Steel team.